Joe Musgrave was named the offensive coordinator for the Oakland Raiders seven hours ago, and Musgrave was most recently the quarterback's coach of the Philadelphia Eagles. Prior to that, he was offensive coordinator with the Minnesota Vikings, and then before that, he was offensive coordinator with the Atlanta Falcons. But I remember Bill Musgrave when he was a backup quarterback during the Joe Montana era. Bill Musgrave, since then, quickly went into the coaching ranks, first, first with the 49ers, was known as one of the people who knew Bill Walsh West Coast offense. He has then, since then, taken the basics of the West Coast offense and expanded on it and is an expert at using the West Coast offense and applying it to the different personnel situations he's experienced with the teams that he has been with, with through the National Football League. The ones that I mentioned, and oh, there's also the Philadelphia Eagles, really twice because he was with, the, with them when Ray Rhodes was the coach, and then, of course, he went back to them, and he was with the Oakland Raiders as, as a coach. His first official coaching stint out as a as a first stint as a coach after being a player, and then he went back to the 49ers. The bottom line is Bill Musgrave has been all over the NFL. And if you think about it, you've got Bill Musgrave, Mike Tice. This is Bill Musgrave here. If you want to know what he looks like, this is that's the guy right there. That's Bill Musgrave. Okay, and uh, you can take a look at the images of associated with him, and there he is, and uh, different getups over the years. Falcons, Vikings over here, there, there. He's got a little hat there. I don't know if that's a Nick Saban influence or what. He's 47 years old, hails from Grand Junction, Colorado, and um, I'm actually really excited to, that he's coming. I know that there are people who, over the years, have criticized his offense, but he's also known as a person who, particularly with the Minnesota Vikings, really established Tavon Austin's career because he designed great schemes to take advantage of Austin's speed, and he also designed neat formations for Adrian Peterson and managed to line up Peterson in different ways to get the best out of him, out of him so that teams didn't zero in on one particular type of play and stop that play. Something that the Raiders have suffered from under previous coaching regimes with the exception of Hugh Jackson. So Hugh Jackson really is the outlier over the years here. So I'm really excited that Bill Musgrave is coming here, but I'm most interested to know what he learned under Chip Kelly and if he's going to bring any elements of the Chip Kelly offense to the Raider offense.